some upcoming events that you would like to highlight through DRR. Yeah, um, next Tuesday, we're going to be uh, uh, putting our, going down to Montgomery and pursuing our Independent Living Advocacy Day, which, I mean, advocacy, as we've talked about, is, is a big deal. And, we, and when you're going down to the, uh, to the state house and, the, you know, the state congress and talking to the legislators, you're really hitting the, uh, the systems advocacy part of it. So that we're, we at our agency, is, uh, along with, um, you know, other groups uh, that, we, uh, that we work uh, closely with, are all going to be going down there on Tuesday. And Who do you guys have lined up to speak with? Um, it, it, that's that's a that's a real fluid uh, question because I mean uh, you know we have um, we have some senators and some congressmen involved, uh, but then we have uh, some uh, local community members that are going to be uh, you know highlighted. You know, so it it really um, I want I want to. Um, I don't want to let the cat out of the bag just yet. Yeah, no, that's okay. So yeah, um, maybe we'll do another one easy. You can tell me about it. Right, right. But then uh, on the uh, let's see, on April seventeenth, uh, that's gonna we have we're gonna have our uh, employment network. Uh, each each month, we try to do a uh, session on the employment network where it's uh, it's kind of just sort of orientation. Uh, uh, you know, this is what it is. This is what it isn't. You know, so uh, April seventeenth is gonna be that. Yeah. But then there's the the big event that we do every year. It's the uh, Magic City Chocolate Challenge. I saw that on the Facebook page, but I, I didn't go too deep into it. So yeah. if you would speak about that. Yeah, so that is our annual fundraiser. And this year, I think th we, this is our fifth year of doing it. So, you know, this year it's going to be at Regents Park, okay. uh, which, which is the ball field downtown, which yeah. is, you know, it's, it's an amazing place to hold. It's a hold really cool spot. Yeah. So basically it's a, um, we, we, we uh, bring in uh, different chefs that, that uh, make chocolate dishes. And then we, um, you know, you, you can test it. Hopefully you don't make yourself sick. Yeah, it's eat gonna too be, much chocolate. Because, it, because it's going to be a lot of chocolate. Uh, so you have to be careful with that. Yeah. But it's um, it's really a good event towards, uh, you know, learning learning about, of course, the different, the different chocolates and learn, learning about who we are. And then uh, basically just, it's just an environment to just kind of sort of come in, let your hair down. There's uh there's going to be a silent auction. There's going to be, of course, it's re Regents Hill, so they'll, so they'll have the, uh, they should have the ballpark open. I'm not sure on that. Yeah. Hopefully they will. Cause, uh, is yeah. it going to be going on during a live game? They're not going to be a live game. I, I don't, I don't think so. Yeah. I don't think so. But that's going to be, uh, let's see, uh, um, uh, April 30th. April 30th. Yeah. This month. It's uh, 5:30 to 8 at Regents Field. I'd like to come. Yeah, and so so what you could do is um, there there's there's a couple of ways to uh, to get tickets. Yeah, uh, you can either uh, go on our um, website uh, drradvocates.org, and then there's a little button. It says Magic City Chocolate Challenge. And then you can click, you can click on that, and then you can order tickets that way, or you can call our agency, which is two zero five two five one two 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 three, and then uh, we can hook you up with tickets that way. Yeah. Do you have to order them? Because I'm a little bit of a procrastinator. Can I order them like the day before? Yeah, or, it's well, just like an e-ticket. Yeah, which I order. Yeah, well, I you can get them at the day, at the door too. Oh, you can. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So, uh, but yeah, no, there's um, there's lots of different ways to get them. Yeah, that uh, I imagine is pretty big turnout at that facility, and everybody loves chocolate. Yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, yeah, yeah. You <laughs> so, can't say no to dessert. No, yeah, no, you tough. can't. So, but it, and like I said, it's a, uh, it's a, it's a lot of. It's a lot of variety, but it's it's a really fun event. So where you're you're just kind of sort of is is like I said, it's a way to kind of sort of chill out and yeah. really just uh, enjoy the environment. And it's, I'm, I'm happy it's in April because it being outside, it's not too hot yet. Yeah, you know, it's kind of getting to that point where it's getting a little sticky, but it's still pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Because it, it, we used to have it in June, and, oh, and yeah, it was you had to be inside at that. It point. was it was brutal. If yeah, you, if you were not inside, I mean, you're eating chocolate. Plus, it's June in Alabama, yeah. sweating face. And yeah, so so we tried it. We try we tried it. We're gonna try it a little bit earlier this year. So again, uh, June thirtieth, uh, five thirty at eight. And then, uh, yeah, just uh, come out and support us. I want some uh, chocolate-covered strawberries. Do you guys do, they do stuff like that? Well, you just have to come and see. I got, I got real, dude. I You're got just going to have to come and see. <laughs>